Good morning, class. I am Messi P. Ramadan, and you can call me Teacher Messi. Okay, before we start our class today, let us have the prayer first. Who wants to volunteer for our prayer? Anyone from the class? Okay, Jane, please come forward to lead the prayer. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Angel of God, my guardian there, to whom God's love permits me here. Ever this day, be at my side, to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, class. Thank you, Jane. You may now sit down, class. And before we start our lesson for today, let's have the roll call first. Okay? Stay present if your name is called. Abelia Ronald Vincent. Present, ma'am. Okay. Acosta Glenn. Present. Cortez John Michael. Present. Coligado Ruli. Present. De La Cruz Dominic. Present. Flores Anthony. Present. Her Samuel John Dave. Present. Herrera Steven. Present. Humawid Carl. Present. Apartelli Jane. Present. Bartolome Margaret. Present. De Guzman Scarlett. Present. Gray Monique. Present. Hermes Crisley. Present. Insu Angel May. Present. Laura Nicole. Present. Mendoza Erich. Present. And Ortiz Elsa May. Present. Wow, very good. No one is absent. And because of that, each one of you will receive a 10 points. Okay, clap your hands. Okay, who among you here loves to listen a story? Me, teacher, me. Okay, okay, okay. Put your hands down. So now, I will be presenting a short story. And the title of this story is Never Give Up. I want you to listen carefully in every word they say because I will be giving a follow-up questions regarding the story presented. Do you understand, class? Okay, very good. You give up? Kitty is very fast. And we are too slow. Oh, look at you. So soon? Haven't you heard about the bee and the earthworm? Listen. In the beginning, there were two little worms who lived in a garden. They were called Sam and Rocky. They were friends and ambitious. They would look at the beautiful flowers for hours and dream of touching them. But both of them were very small and moved very slowly. One fine day, they decided that they have to reach the flowers. They started jumping toward the flower in the morning. It was until noon they jumped, but they couldn't touch the flowers. They were sweating and panting. But to fulfill their dream, they had to keep jumping and not stop. Rocky says he wants to quit, but Sam keeps on pushing him. By trying continuously, their jumping has improved a lot to give up just now. If they give up now, they'll never see the flowers again. Life will be the same, miserable. Sam keeps motivating Rocky, but finally Rocky gives up. He stays down on the ground. Sam is sad that his friend is not with him and he has to finish the journey alone now. The sun is getting on top. Sam rests for a while and starts to jump again. He feels scratch on his back. He touches it and feels like growing some soft wafer-like plates on his back. Gradually it grows and becomes his wings. Sam can move his wings now. He moves his wings and flaps them to move forward and now he can't believe it, he can fly! He flies on top of the flower and even farther into the sky to see the whole garden. 
It is so beautiful he has never seen anything like this. He sits on the flowers and touches them and never comes back. Meanwhile, Rocky keeps crawling on the ground eating soil. Today we know Sam's kind as the bees and Rocky's kind as the earthworm. See, you should never give up. Never, never ever, 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 ever. Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Who are the characters of the story? Me, teacher, me. Yes, John Dave. Rocky and Sam, teacher. Okay, very good. Now, let's give John Dave a fireworks clock. Okay, one, two, three. Shh. One, two, three. Shh. Shh, 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 shh. On the story presented, what is their name in general when they didn't know yet their identity me teacher yes nicole a worm teacher okay very good now let's give nicole a alin janisha clock okay one two three one two three very good very good very good okay class our lesson last meeting is all about a noun teacher. Okay, very good. What is a noun again? Okay, Chrisley. A noun is refers to a name of a person, a place, or a thing. Okay, very good. Now let's give Chrislyn another fireworks clock. One, two, three. Shh, 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 shh. Okay, class. Who can give a fun example of a noun? Me, teacher. Yes, Carl? Cardo the Lisay teacher. Okay, very good. Next? Me, teacher. Yes? Teacher, teacher. Okay, very good. What else? Me, teacher. Yes, Carlet. School teacher. Okay, very good. Another one? Me, teacher. Yes? A flower teacher. Okay, very good. And last one? Me, teacher. Yes, Monique. Jose Rizal teacher. Okay, very good. All of your answers are correct. Give yourself a round of applause. Okay, class. For deeper understanding of our lesson today, teacher Ira will discuss it to you. I want you to listen carefully and behave. Am I understand, class? Yes, teacher. Okay. Now, I will give the floor to Teacher Ira.